A young girl from Queens thriving once again after doctors removed a massive growth from her neck. We first met Sandy Diaz two years ago, right before her surgery. Now we meet her again, and her family says she's got a bright future ahead. Eyewitness News reporter Lauren Glassberg has the story. Sandy Diaz is a sweet preschooler who is fond of her Peppa Pig. And while you wouldn't know it by looking at her now, this is how she looked two years ago, with a massive growth that engulfed much of her face. It was also wrapped around the main arteries of the neck, the carotid artery and the internal jugular vein, and every structure in the head and neck was infiltrated with this. It really was one of the most complex dissections that we do um, in this type of surgery. Doctors Milton Weiner and Teresa O oh of Lenox Hill were able to remove about 98% of that lymphatic malformation. Her mother, Maricela Benitez, says Sandy is much better and she's very happy with the outcome. But today, at Manhattan Eye, Ear and Throat Hospital, Sandy's doctors are treating her again. This time, they're injecting the three-year-old with bleomycin, which will help shrink any remaining pockets of malformation. And then doctors can address her facial bones, which were affected by that growth. When she's a little older and her facial skeleton is more fully grown, we can adjust things to give her much more symmetry. Sandy still has some challenges. She has trouble chewing and a little bit of trouble speaking. She gets occupational therapy, which will continue for about a year or so. Her mom hopes that Sandy can soon sit down with her six siblings and enjoy a meal with them. And doctors say that will happen soon enough. Lauren Glassberg, Channel 7, Eyewitness News.